Welcome to Fem Magazine. Today we have a new topic, commercial photography company. So listen carefully. Points to consider when starting a commercial photography company. If you think you are creative with a camera, then the drive of opening your own company should come naturally. In recent years, photography as a profession has gained ground. To this effect, it requires hard work and diligence to stand out from the rest of amateur shooters. However, that should not deter you from achieving your dream of starting your own commercial photography company. As mentioned above, you are not one among a few. Most people would look at you as a wild card. On the contrary, they will advise you negatively just because most known photographers do not do it for the money but is a pastime activity. When you are at the receiving end of these statements, do not be deterred, pretend to give credence and offer a grin. Read a lot in order to have extensive knowledge about the industry. The emergence of digital cameras has made a turn around to the industry. These technological changes have made it easy for people to buy the needed gear. Moreover, with the big number of amateur photographers it is hard to get even a rough estimate of the industrial size. When starting up any enterprise, a business plan is important. Have this plan regardless of the type of photography you practice. Successful photographers recommend prepare this document because it gives clear guidelines about how to run the business. In it there are details concerning the expenses to be incurred, the tactical measures to ensure the business breaks even as well as how to weather the competition. Before you start offering photography services, you need to acquire the necessary startup apparatuses. For instance, a camera may cost about $10,000. Legal documents such as licenses, insurance and an online site also need cash to obtain. Furthermore, depending on whether you will need to open a studio in San Diego, could slot overhead costs such as rent in your budget. A freelancer, however, needs no studio. Many experts recommend that you gain enough training. It is because training gives one an upper hand in making the business thrive. One can achieve professional status through many ways. Offering Assistance services to an expert photographer offers a window of opportunity to learn the nitty-gritties of the industry. In addition, attending photography classes also helps you learn about the trade aspect. Depending on the shooting, at times, you may be required to hire additional hands to help with the job. Therefore, decide whether you need staff. Most photographers run their companies as sole proprietors. Nonetheless, it is quite cheap to get an assistant because they are only needed when the need arises. In fact, most assistants are not paid. In case they receive any remuneration, the amount is small. As you look forward to start your photography company, establish a good portfolio. You will need it when promoting your photography skills to a prospective client. Also, make use of social media to reach out to a wider market. For instance, you may be a blogger. This way you can make your work known to many. Please subscribe and share for more videos. Thanks.